the match, Michaela, well, last week wasn't brilliant for Lamming, was it? It was wet, it was windy, it also turned cold. This week, much milder air, and it's probably looking a bit better for those spring bulbs as well. The reason? Well, the winds are changing direction. They're coming into the southwest. You can see the colours on the arrows. But uh, it will turn a bit cold around the middle of the week, we think, and then we're back into the mild air as we head into Thursday and Friday. Fairly mild southwesterly winds, but they are likely to be quite strong and gusty at times. They're going to bring some weather fronts with them, so that means there will be some wet weather around, mainly across northern and western parts of the British Isles, as you'll be able to see here. Most of us are going to be sandwiched between those weather fronts for most of the week in the mild air. But the cold air is going to be pushing back, uh, particularly into the northern Isles and perhaps into the northeastern corner of Scotland for a time. We're not exactly sure where that low is going to go, but that's our best bet at the moment. But by the time we get to Thursday and Friday, once again, as the isobars and the weather fronts indicate, we'll be back in that mild southwesterly regime. So those gusty southwesterly winds pushing in across Scotland this afternoon. Not dry, though. They are bringing some rain with them, perhaps some heavy rain for the northwest highlands, and some of that rain getting into Northern Ireland and also into northwestern parts of England late on in the day. Clearer skies to the south, a bit of sunshine there, perhaps even a, a touch of frost to start the night in southeastern parts of Britain. But as the winds increase, I think temperatures will recover by the time we get around to tomorrow morning. The reason, well, not only the winds increasing, but the amount of cloud increasing overnight. Always uh, thicker to the north and west, that's where we'll continue to see some rain and some drizzle and also some mists on coasts and hills. So quite a chilly start to Monday, particularly across the southeast of Britain, but temperatures picking up quite well into the mild category category by the afternoon, but always a lot more cloud across northern and western parts of the British Isles, and that's where we'll have some rain, some drizzle, and some mist. As we move into Tuesday, well, it looks as though that cold air will start to push into the northern Isles, so perhaps a bit of sleet, and perhaps by Wednesday, a bit of snow there. But you'll also find some rain pushing across England and Wales, with some brighter skies getting into Northern Ireland and eventually pushing across the Irish Sea. But we're likely to keep quite a little bit of cloud uh, out to the southwest. Some more of that mist and drizzle I hinted at. And then that mild air starts to push in once again. So as we get back to the end of the week, we'll find temperatures picking up in the far north, a lot of cloud in the north and west, but some brighter skies, particularly in the east. That's the forecast.